There are two types of VIA wizards to define the parameters of a VIA structure and generate a VIA model for simulation. Secrety VIA wizard and Aurora VIA wizard. For the purpose of this demonstration, we will proceed with the Aurora VIA wizard to generate VIA models. This video introduces the usage of the Aurora VIA wizard to generate VIA models that can be used in an Allegro design in the pre-layout phase. After viewing this video, you will be able to place a VIA block, define the VIA structure, and generate the VIA model. Consider the following prerequisites before running the Aurora VIA wizard. Search for the VIA block button in the add block panel. Drag the VIA block and place it on the canvas. Double-click the block to open the Edit Properties panel. Click the Aurora VIA Wizard button. The Secrety Aurora window opens with the VIA Wizard workflow option selected in it. Click Define Cross-Section. The Cross-Section Editor window opens. Enter the Stack Up layers, thickness, and material properties as per the design requirements. Now click Create VIA Structure. The Create Structure dialog box opens. You can choose to create differential pair via structure or a single-ended via structure with a return path. For the purpose of this demonstration, we will create a differential pair via structure with a return path. Input the desired values as per the requirements of your design and click Generate. Note that a green check mark now appears before create via structure. This means that the via structure is generated on the canvas, as shown here. Click View 3D Geometry. In the 3D view, you can see the VIA barrels, entry and exit traces, along with the return path VIA structure when the dielectrics and conductors options for VIA are enabled. Now, click Setup Analysis Options. The IDA VIA Wizard Analysis Parameters Setup dialog box opens with the simulation option selected in it. Edit the port reference impedance and specify the output format for the network parameters as per your design. In the Clarity 3D Layout section, edit the frequency settings as per the requirements of your design. Now, click Start Extraction to extract the S parameter for the VIA structure. On successful completion of the extraction, the Secrety Aurora window closes automatically and the extracted VIA model is refreshed in Topology Explorer. Review the model definition in the Subcircuit Editor and close the dialog box. Now, connect the VIA block to the transmitter IBIS, TX, receiver IBIS, RX, and strip line blocks of differential configuration, as shown here. After checking the connectivity and defining the analysis options for the topology, simulate the topology by clicking on the Start Transient Analysis button. On successful completion of the simulation run, the SSI viewer window opens. You can select signals of the VIA block that connect to the transmitter and receiver blocks, respectively. This helps to review the simulation waveform results generated between these blocks.